Hi everybody, so this is what the inside of my Yesu FR101S looks like. And you can tell a lot of quality components were used in this. If you've ever seen the videos online, you can see all the staff in like the Yesu factories and other places like that where they hand soldered all these together. It wasn't done by a machine back then, it was all done by a hand. Now there's been a few modifications to this. And when I say modifications, I don't mean the normal ones that you expect. It's got this silly white cable, which I'm going to remove and do differently because this goes to the power. Um, because the Asus have this really funny connector on the back. Where one side of that connector is 24 volts and the other side of it is 240. And I don't know if you can see how close them pins are together. But they are shockingly close together. So yeah, I mean the quality of um, workmanship inside here yeah, is amazing. You know, it's uh, it's been really well put together. I don't think this has had much done to it over the years. I've owned this particular radio um, for probably, I'd say I'd ha I've had this radio 20 years. So um, it's probably due a bit of a service. You can replace some of the capacitors and things in it. We do recommend you do that every so often. Uh, but this is looking inside the bottom of it. So it's sort of kind of like upside down if you want at the minute. But just look how they, they used to tie the cables together. You know, somebody somebody actually did all that by hand. You know, it's amazing, isn't it, really, when you think about it. But yeah, that's the inside of... Uh, my Yesu. Also, I've got, you might notice this white cable here. Um, this basically goes to what would be the speaker input because it's actually got speaker fitted, an internal speaker. Again, this was done before I had it. So, I might take that speaker out and just keep with the external speaker. I don't know yet. Um, I haven't used it for some time. And this is the reason for digging it out. Um, it's sort of been sat on the side for like two or three years now since I moved stuff around and I haven't used it. So I was going to um, sort the power cable issue out on the back and uh, get it back in use and do a few videos. Um, see what we can pick up. So there you go. That's the Yesu FR101S. A, uh, a look inside. If you've got any questions or comments, let me know and I'll uh, probably post another video up when I open the top up and we'll have a look inside the top.